With two boxes, simple human-robot dialogues can be created. You need a set language box and a dialogue box. Let's look at a dialogue first. Hi, Cody. Hello, Diana. How are you? I'm fine. Thanks for asking. Good to hear that. Enjoy your day. See you soon. See you. Bye-bye. Having activated English as supported application language in the project content, we can start creating a dialogue in that language. Essential for a dialogue is the dialogue box. It is created directly in the main workspace. With a right mouse click on the workspace, a selection box opens in which we can make the basic settings for the box via Create a new box, then Dialogue. A new box is created via Add Topic. It can then be given a name, for example, Test Box, and the dialogue language is selected. With Add and OK, the dialogue box is then displayed on the screen and its components become files in the project files. Now we create the dialogue. For this purpose, we open the Dialog Editor by clicking on the TOP file in the Project Files. In the Editor, you can already see the topic of the box and then the dialog language. Now we type in what the human is allowed to say in brackets, following a U for user with a colon. Directly after that follows the answer of the robot without brackets. Using this syntax, we can now enter our simple question-answer game in the dialog editor. Always according to the principle, what the human is expected to say in brackets, with the robot answer immediately afterwards. With the expression see you, we want to end the dialog. For the robot to interpret this as the end, the answer is followed by the expression dollar symbol on stopped equals one. This leads to a termination of the dialog box via the box output on stopped. Finally, we have to connect the boxes. The program start with the start input of the set language box, then the on ready output of the set language box with the start input of the dialog box, and finally, the stop output of the dialog box with the program end. Now we can check the dialog using the dialog box on the virtual robot or run it on a real robot. How to extend these simple dialogues is explained in further videos.